This procedure is split into three videos. This is the third video, running tests and performing chromatography. Before proceeding, you must calibrate your fluorometer using the first video and prepare the reagents using the second video. The test has three simple steps, extraction, dilution, and chromatography. Sample extraction. For this step, you need the lab blender, a 100 milliliter graduated cylinder, a scale, clean collection cup, and the fluted filter paper. Combine in the lab blender 50 grams of ground sample, 5 grams of non-iodized salt, kosher salt is acceptable for this, and 100 milliliters of 80-20 methanol. Tighten the lid carefully and align the jar with the posts on the blender motor base. Blend on high for 60 seconds. Gently fold the edges of the fluted filter paper over the clean collection cup and collect the filtrate in the cup and the filter. For extract dilution, you will need a pipetter, a graduated cylinder, a microfiber filter, a funnel, and two clean collection cups. Measuring with a graduated cylinder, always align with the bottom of the meniscus of the water. To dilute, combine 10 milliliters of filtered sample extract with 20 milliliters of purified water. Mix the diluted extract by pouring back and forth into a clean collection cup. Filter using the microfiber filter. Pour directly through the filter into another clean collection cup. The final step requires a 1 milliliter pipetter, a Vicam pump stand with syringe and column coupler, a waste collection cup, and the Vicam fluorometer. Remove the top and bottom cap from an Aflatest test column. Gently tap to remove the buffered solution from the column. Pipette one milliliter of diluted filtered extract directly into the top of the Aflatest column head. Avoid touching the edge of the column. Attach the column to the pump stand. Apply pressure carefully and pass one to two drops per second through the column. Once air has passed through the column, remove from the pump stand. Using the water wash bottle, fill the headspace of the column completely with water. This will add exactly one milliliter to the column. Apply pressure and pass one to two drops per second until air passes through the column. Now, repeat the last step. Add one milliliter of water directly to the column head, apply pressure, and pass one to two drops per second through the column until air passes through the column. Remove the column from the pump stand. Place a glass cuvette under the column. Use the methanol pump bottle to add one milliliter of pure methanol directly to the column head space. Attach back onto the pump stand. Add pressure carefully and pass one drop per second through the column. Remember, methanol is less dense than water and will pass through the column faster. Use care for this step. Once air has passed through the column, remove the cuvette. Add one milliliter of Aflatest developer. Shake the cuvette gently to mix. Wipe the cuvette and place immediately in the fluorometer. You'll have results in 60 seconds. The printer will produce a time date stamped receipt of your test. You can also retrieve a record of the results through the USB port to a Windows-based computer.